Hi everyone, it's Nancy Bastien, and I thought I would do some arting today and um, paint some deli paper. And have you guys come with me on the journey of painting deli paper? How about it? I want to get rid of some of these paints, and so I'm just going to pour some on this deli paper and uh, scrape some on here. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. And you know what? I don't have a place to hang these to dry, so I don't know. I don't wanna put too much paint on them. I'm just gonna do, uh, get basic, uh, coat of paint on one, you know, and then I'll come back and do some stenciling and what have you on them. But anyway, um, not too much has been going on around here. We've uh, had our anniversary yesterday, my husband and I. We've been married now eight years. And we still love each other. How about that, huh? Cool, huh? Yes. We knew we did. But anyway. Um, yeah, I just want to get some paint used up. And so I thought I'd bring you along for the little ride here. So, I don't know where I'm going to set these. I'm just going to hopefully set them over here and they'll dry fast. My mother-in-law and my sister-in-law came over yesterday and um, we uh, got some, they got to see my new dining room table and chairs and we got some food out and ate out, ate here, and my mother-in-law is 89 years old, and she's on oxygen, and she did really, really well coming in here yesterday and um, climbing the stairs, and she just loves my house, and loves my dining room, and um, she just loves my house. She said it has character. And it does because it's a Cape Cod home, you know, and it, it has the ceilings that are slanted upstairs in the bed in the bedrooms and that's it's just beautiful. And the hardwood floors are gorgeous and yeah, I'm really loving my house. These are some studio paints by Claudine Helmut. I bought them at Tuesday morning quite a while ago, and I've never used them. So I thought, well, I better start getting some painting done with those. And, um... Use up all my paint. Get all this paint used up. And try not to buy any more. Until it's all gone. We finally warmed up. And I got my first energy bill today. Yay! My first light and gas bill. I was really worried about it, but it's not too bad. And our garbage and water bill comes every three months. Can you believe that? So it's going to, it'll be a big bill. But I guess that's how they work it around here. Combine it for three months. Um, I've been practicing my girl faces 
And I'll show you one that I drew today and painted earlier today. Ooh, that almost dropped and I went on my new white pants I bought yesterday. Not yesterday, day before yesterday. Anyway, this is the girl that I drew and painted. What do you guys think? She's on the back of some paper I stamped with some butterflies. So, see the butterflies through her face? That's why. But, what do you think? Do you think I did a pretty good job in shading her face? I used uh, my Prima watercolor pencils. And I didn't put much water on this paper because it's just cardstock and I didn't want to work the paper too much. So I need your comments and let me know how I did with with coloring her and, and how I can improve it. Can you see? You see? Because I really want to learn how to how to shade and how to do all the so, comments on critiquing me, I do not take offense to. I take knowledge to that. And if anybody can help me out there, great. I would love all the help I can get. So, um, I just decided that I needed to practice and practice and practice. And take some hints from uh, Veronica and Kelly Donovan and anybody else who draws faces out there. Rita Marie. And see so if I could put them all together. I do have books, and I could get out my books and learn from them. I do have. Susie Blue, and I have the Jane Davenport Facebook, but, you know, I could get those out and read them, I guess, but I don't, I just don't, I don't know why. Put some blue metallic down here. And then I'm going to go back and do some other stuff on these papers. But I ran out of papers. I sent them all to Victor. I see that he's making all the books. And every page he turns to, he says, Nancy Bastien. And this is Nancy Bastien. <laughs> I'm so glad he's using my papers. That makes me happy when I send people stuff and they use it like that. Uh, I did send him a lot of my jelly plated papers and so I have not got very many left and I wanted to do some jelly printing and I think I will. Maybe I'll get my jelly plate out and I'll pause this video and but I just don't have a place to put them to dry. I gotta figure out a place to hang them. I don't know. I um, had to take down all my stencils that I had on my hanging on my boom arm like uh, Claudia Rossi does or did before she packed up all her stuff to go to Hawaii and they just didn't work here because my uh, I have another table and my boom arms quite a ways away and so it weighed my boom arm down too much, and I couldn't get an even weight on it. So it was collapsing, so I had to take all my stencils off. And uh, I don't know, I gotta figure out. 
a way to hang these up. So anyway, what has all been going on with you guys? I've been trying to catch up on my YouTube videos. It's really been hard. Uh, I've missed a lot without internet. And I just love my house so much that I just, yeah, I just try to keep up on my housework and um, that makes my pain level go up higher and doing all that stuff. I don't know. I go to the doctor on Friday. I hope she'll maybe raise the milligrams of my pain medication. I hate to do that, but I just can't tolerate the, the level, the high levels of pain. And I was doing so good, but I wasn't doing any housework at the other, at, uh, my mother-in-law's place, I, you know. Other than making beds and stuff like that, I wasn't like scrubbing floors and, you know, doing all that stuff. And so that's been really hard on my body. But, oh, well, who cares? Who wants to know about that? That's just how it goes. Y'all just want to hear about art stuff. So, uh, my furniture will be here on the... 26th of May. I can hardly wait. They didn't have all the pieces and I didn't want to. They asked me if I wanted them. This delivered this day. Woo, this is bright. Woo and this piece delivered on that day. And the rug delivered on. And I just said, no. I want it all at one time. I don't want piece here and piece there. And yeah. I didn't have to pay for delivery, but still, I just didn't want, when they get it all together, then deliver it. I can't believe they didn't have all my pieces to my furniture that I picked out, you know, in the warehouse. But I guess it was a popular, maybe piece of furniture and everybody was buying it because it was such a good buy. My um, couch was like, originally was like a thousand dollars and then they had it marked down to eight hundred dollars and then with this sale they had going on and means they were advertising the sale on TV that they Marked it down again to $500. So I got my couch and my overstuffed chair both for $500 each, which I thought that was really good buy because they were quite expensive furniture. Very well built. Can hardly wait till you guys can see it. Yeah, it'll be really pretty. And y'all will invite you all over to my house. And we'll, you can see my furniture, my new rug. Yeah, we'll have a party here. How's that? Whoever wants to come can come. And I'm whizzing right through these. Yep, doesn't take long to scrape paint on a piece of paper. Get this paint used up. Yep, I need to do that. I got a little doggy behind me sitting in the chair. Little belly. Little, little bell. She's sitting behind me on the chair. My husband's taking a nap, and Molly's upstairs with him, and 
Belle can't go up the stairs. Or she won't. She could, but she don't want to. So... She's hanging out with her... Ooh, that had a booger in it. With her mom. In the art room. Ew. Icky. Ick. I haven't used these very much. Why did they get a booger in them? Ew. Nasty. Ew. Now I have it on my fingers. Ugh. I hate it on my fingers. Pucky. You don't like my fingers dirty, my hands dirty. I guess that's why I don't like mixing bread with my hands. I can't stand all that dough on my hands. But I don't have a bread mixer, and I don't make bread anymore. So what am I worried about it for, huh? That's a pretty color. Hey, that's parrot blue. I don't know where it went to. Let's see. What color is that? Turquoise. Turquoise. Well, yeah, it's turquoise, all right. That's about the color that my chair's gonna be in my, that I bought for my bedroom. Well, guys, I had so much fun buying furniture. It was fun, fun, fun. I haven't done that in so many years bought new furniture for myself one more then I think I'm gonna turn the video off and start a new one with the jelly plate uh, put an apron on because I don't want to get um, get me a wet wipe. I don't want to get paint on my new pants that I bought yesterday and my new shirt. Not yesterday, the day before. Yeah, it's, the weather's turned off really warm, so I've been able to have my windows open out here in my art room, and oh, it's been nice. It's really nice. really enjoying it. Okay, I'm going to use this other one of Studio by Claudine Halmut. It's a writer. It's in a little writer bottle. Let's make art. Oh, that's fun. I don't throw these little bottles away because they are good to put paint in for writing. Well, that's a pretty color. That must have a salmon color, I think. Oh no, let's see. What color? Altered orange. Well, yeah. Okay. Alright, guys, I'm going to get the jelly plate out and I'll be right back with the starting of another video because I don't know how to pause my camera. Somebody needs to teach me how to do that. Hint, hint, whoever knows how. It's a Sony camcord. How do you pause it? I don't know how to edit. And I don't know how to fast forward. So, we just keep on going. Oh, but I love my fiber optics, guys. I was going to tell you. Um, I got... 
internet over here is fiber optic and so it is so fast I uploaded my last video on YouTube in 22 minutes the upload is really really fast I couldn't believe it I was I was thinking oh, this is gonna take all day to upload and zoom it was on there on there and ready to be published I was like whoa that was really fast all right guys I'll be right back see you in a little bit bye bye